What you've been through is unimaginable. But I can't help you unless you open up. Miss Walker. Miss Walker. 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 Fetch! Please, tell me what happened. Okay. My parents called me in when they found that I had powers. I was... dumbstruck. But my brother Brent, he always took care of me. He just grabbed my hand and we ran. Spent a few years living on the streets, staying out of sight, keep it on the move. We did some shitty things to make money, but that job we pulled before leaving Seattle, worse than the rest of it combined. Come on, sis. It's just one more job. It's all loaded up. Let's just go. No, this one's the payday. Mm-hmm. How much? Enough to rent a decent place. <sighs> yeah? Yeah. Enough for a short-tailed Burmese cat. Huh? Oh, that's <laughs> low. <laughs> it's enough for a fresh start. We could use one. Shit, get out, get out! What? It's the cops. Right, you hide, hide! I'll distract them. No, wait! You do this job, we leave tonight. No one will be able to find us? Y yeah, as soon as... No. No! Do not use your powers! I'm not gonna kill anyone, just... Carry my weight. Fetch! Okay. Hey! You! Come over here. Look at me. Eyes up! Right here. Uh, is this really necessary? Officer Hall! One to process. All right, kid. Over here. Seen a kid with a mohawk on this dock? If I search that boat of yours, am I gonna find him? Wait! You wanna see a trick? Ren always pushed me to keep my power secret. If anyone knew a conduit was in town, there'd be a manhunt. And it happened before. But that night, I wasn't worried. I'd use my powers to get the job done, then the two of us would take off. We'd be miles away before the DUP showed up. with this cop on my ass. started the glow, whole city went crazy. This is too dangerous. We need to leave now. The DUP is coming. I thought you wanted a fresh start. And you know I want that cat. Just tell me what the job is so I can do it. Uh, fine. Just be fast. It's the penthouse at Third and Stone. Break in, grab the red duffel bag. Okay. What's in the bag? You get it? And we're leaving with a literal boatload of cash. <laughs> I like the sound of that. We'll get out of Dodge, bro. You're always one step ahead of me. Just be fast. The thought of you in a DUP prison, I couldn't live with myself. <sighs> Swanky. <sighs> Locked. Knock, knock.
Charge up. Gonna need it. Okay. Fetch, you okay? Were you in that? What happened? The place was full of Russians dancing around a bomb. Shit. The occurrence. They found him. Found who? My boss. If they knew about the penthouse, then they'll know about our boat. We gotta go now. Fine. Warm up the engine. I'll be right there. I'm sorry about all this. I really wanted to get you that Burmese cat. I know. Next time. Patch, stay away from the boat. The currents are just outside. They got guns. What? I'll be right there. No. You have one of your panic attacks near these guys. They'll freaking take you. I'm keeping it together just fine. I got you. Now hang up and hide, dummy. Brent? Brent? Brent! Come on, dummy. Where are you? You. Whenever I'd start to freak out, I'd focus on Brent. It was the only thing that'd calm me down. I clung to a good memory. First night in Seattle, we found this overpass and got out of the rain. Ended up reading comics by flashlight until we fell asleep. Later, this guy snuck in and tried to steal what little we had. And I was about to make him pay for it. But that night, we established the rules. Rule number one, no powers, no matter what. We might lose some gear, but Brent didn't want us to lose us. I shouldn't have used my powers. It was my fault he was gone. It was my... I lost it. Those breaks from reality changed me. I'd wake up with new powers. It was like my body decided to fight, but my mind just gave up. You've been very forthcoming, Miss Walker. How about a break? You can show me the skill you acquired from your mental snap. I thought you wanted to get control of your powers. That's what we're here for. I don't know. Last time I used them. We'll start with something simple. I'll be watching your progress from up there. Please don't try anything stupid. stupid. All I do is stupid. No, Miss Walker. You're a survivor.
Everyone has a weakness. You just have to look for it. There you go. It's a start, but the world won't wait for you. Sometimes you need to act fast, follow your instincts. Not bad, not great, but you just started. Perhaps you'd like more relatable targets. Impressive, aren't they? These hard light holograms look and feel real. Now, please kill them. I don't just mindlessly shoot things, okay? Oh, the conduit up here making those holograms, Eugene, he won't mind. What's the point? The point is survival. Not just for you, but for those who can't defend themselves. Go on, protect him. Nice to see you still have some fight in you. Let's hope your other senses are still as sharp. That'll do for now. Take a seat. I'd like you to resume your explanation of what happened in Seattle. After a night of tearing up the city looking for my brother, I ended up back at what was left of our boat. That's where I met him. He was looking for Brent too. Excuse me, sweetheart. I'm sorry, have you seen a fella rocking a mohawk around here somewhere? Wait, you know... you know Brent? Are you with those Russians? What, what the occurrence? No, hell no. Well, are, are you saying they're the ones who did this? Damn it, they keep kidnapping my employees. Kidnap? Wait! Do you know where they have him? Can you take me? Oh, <laughs> slow down there, sugar. No, I'm sure you do not want to get that pretty face caught up in all this trouble. You know, I don't know what you had worked out with Brent, but, uh... He's my brother. Help me. Brother? Uh, are you Fetch? I'm Shane. Shane? You know, Brent never told me that his sister was such a pretty little thing. Please! Just tell me where to look. Uh, east side, mainly. Thank you. And if you think of anything else, then call me on Brent's phone, all right? Yeah, yeah, sure. Whatever you say, sweetheart. Just make sure you take care of that, all right? Gotta get this city ready for the real me. Need some neon. Lots of neon. Hey there, Fetch. Now, I'll put out my feelers, but these occurrence are on hair triggers. We'll have to move fast on the lead. Okay. I'm already headed for some neon gas. Oh, oh, firecracker. Now, I love huffing gas as much as the next guy, but is that really... It's a trick I picked up back in Jersey. The gas helps me run insanely fast. Is that right? I'm gonna have to take your word on that conduit. What other secrets you got going on under that hood? Yeah. That's big enough. Come on, cough it up! Alright, you lazy neon gas. Go make yourself useful. I need all the firepower I can get. They taste good. Oh, a big one. And it moves. Fetch, sweetheart. Did you have 
have something to do with that black show by the needle? I told you I needed some neon gas. Just focus on Brent. Mm. Well, it was kind of conspicuous. You know, I think it'd be better if you came on back here with me while I poke around with my feelings. Him yeah, for the occurrence. Zipping through those clouds, I'll haul ass. You luscious neon fatty. I'm eating you whole. Woo! Feelers, I get it. You're a creep, okay? It's new pet. Uh, now, now, I will have you know that some women find me irresistible. Sure, if you're paying them. It, look, just meet me in the alley behind that sandwich shop when you're ready to steal the guns, all right? Au revoir. Loaded up. Let's go. I think I set off an alarm breaking in to get the guns. If the currents catch up with us, you better cover my ass. Let's go. It'll be fine. Now, you see, honey, if they find out it was me that stole this stuff, there'll be a retribution which I would very much like to avoid. Come on, you have a conduit on your side. They're hoes. We'll get these guns to your men, and they'll use them to find Brent. We're good. They're stealing our guns! Fetch! Stay close, I gotta. Shoot the conduit! Shoot the conduit! Just for a bit. Give me a chance to recharge. Right. Well, I know just the spot. All right. Back on the road. We should be good. Or not. These guys aren't giving up. Any ideas? I've got an escape plan. Just have to time it right. Dwayne, you ready with the bus? I see you. Coming your way. Bus? Who was that? Brent, he keeps me grounded and low profile. Well, end of the line. We'll unload here. It's fine by me. Come on. We made a hell of a team out there on the streets. Imagine what we'd be like in the sack. 
Get your boys armed and out looking for Brents, or I'll lay a hole in your sack. Whoa, whoa, now what if I told you I already have some guys asking around for your brother? I'll send you their position. They might have heard something by now. You go from creep to okay in just a sentence. How do you do that? Well, born and raised in Texas. I just heard one of my guys out searching for Brent got made by the occurrence. Now, I'm sorry, honey, but I need to call my boys back. It's just too dangerous. No, no, I'll protect him. Tell your men I'll protect anyone out looking for Brent. Ugh! This'll work. I'll shoot him once I open up. Gotta be fast. Shane, your boy's still breathing. Well, I'm glad to hear you're good at this. Cause another one of my guys just got spotted. I'll take care of it. Just send me his location. Come on. <laughs> oh, you saved him? Oh, thank the Lord. I need all the muscle I can get. Look, if you guys are getting spotted, let's use that. Have them all head for Olaf's restaurant by the harbor. I'll head out on top and drop the occurrence when they show. Yeah, now that's not bad. All right, well, I, I could be out back of Olaf's with a truck. And once you open fire, I'll pick up my boys, and then we're gone. Welcome to the meat grinder, boys. Shane, I got their attention. Get you guys out. Yes, ma'am. Shane, you guys okay? Any of them find Brent? Well, I think you motivated them. <laughs> Watching you go to town? Oh, it is incredible, girl. You are the Grim Reaper. I'm not a monster. I'm just... I gotta help my brother. Sometimes I lose it without him. Madam, are in luck. One of the men you just saved? He heard an occurring lieutenant made a collection in Georgetown. Now, if we find this guy on surveillance footage, we may be able to track him back to where they're holding Brent. Every now and then, you're okay. Oh, that mean you're finally gonna let this cowboy ride the bull? Bulls are all male, dude. Yeah, well, whatever. Uh, hello? Fetch. Hi. Uh, my name's Jenny. I work for... with Shane. I guess I'm supposed to help you track down an occurring lieutenant. Over the phone? We'll use city cameras. You get me their IDs, then I'll know where to look for footage. I'm sending you the location where our guy was last seen. Sorry, camera IDs? Who are you again? Jenny. I work for the city, and, uh, sometimes Shane. Uh, the camera ID is like a QR code. You can scan for it using your phone. Send me that, and I can search through its footage for this guy. We've got some killer facial recognition software. It's kind of creepy. All right, I'm here. Find a camera. Okay, got it. Scan me the ID so I can look for footage. That's our guy. Follow him. We'll use individual cameras to find out which way he went. I'm sorry I can't do a full system scan, but it had set off alarms here at work. What are we looking for here? I'm told the occurrence have some kind of safe house where they keep prisoners. If we follow him, he'll lead us to it. And Shane? What's your deal with him? Well, you're looking for your brother. I needed something else. Now when Shane calls, I help him out. I just have to be really careful here at work. Damn. What'd you need? Just don't get in too deep with this kind of stuff. Who is this guy anyway? He's 
a human trafficker for the occurrence. Human trafficking? Like, as in slaves? Yeah. And I think he's following that girl. Picking up the pace. You think she spotted it? Just keep going. Let's find out what happens to her. Looks like there's some sort of crime scene here. Hold on. Looks like you dropped something. Hello. Jenny, do you think you could find out where that guy goes all day if you had his phone? Sure. It'd take a little while. I just need a copy of his SIM card. I'll send it over. We're gonna get my brother back and shut these assholes down at the same time. Bitch! My guy's out beating the bushes, got ambushed by currents. It's bad. So, you want me to rush in and really brutalize the trap suits, huh? Well, yeah. It'll be my distinct pleasure. Just point me in the right direction. Oh, and Jenny kicks ass. Give her a call. We gotta leave. I don't see any of your guys around here. The currents forced them out. They had to run. Got pinned down near the ferry terminal. How many tracks is they up against? Lots. Why? You excited to be the Grim Reaper again? Racking up a body count? I'm just doing this for Brent. <laughs> oh, come on. I watched you last time. Big old smile on your mouth, rage in your eyes. You were into it. I'm fine. I got guys down there taking cover around one of my trucks. Keep them alive, and they'll back you up once Jenny hacks that phone and we go on the warpath for your brother. Front? What is this a war now? Uh, kinda. You and me stole those guns. I arm up my boys, they start kicking in doors looking for Brent, and the occurrence uh, quite naturally get pissed off. It's a gang war. <laughs> and you started it. I know. Help your guys. Oh, come on. Don't be sour. I'm whooping ass here. And once Brent's back, that shouldn't be the end of this arrangement. You and me working together. <laughs> Mountains of very, very profitable drugs. No way. Dupes will be here soon. If I end up locked in Curtain Cape Prison, I'll never get my brother back. Currents are getting desperate. I'm betting they throw everything they got at my boys huddled up near the needle. Good. Hope is in a current parade. 
Saves me the time of running them down. <laughs> there she is. My angel of death. <laughs> bit of that light show. You sure seemed worked up and dishing out all kinds of pain. Gave me chills. I'm just doing this to help my brother. I don't enjoy it. He and I don't do things like this. Oh, oh, I see. <laughs> you don't want old Brent to find out about the real you. Hmm? The Grim Reaper you? The one I happen to cherish so much? Brent keeps me alive and safe. When people see things like what I just did, they freak out. I can't lose any more family. Well, if it's a chokehold on your rage that keeps your brother around, you're ready to tighten your grip. Jenny cracked that occurrence phone. We know where they're keeping hostages. Are you serious? When you're ready, you meet me in front of the Latte Al on Madison. It's go time. Hey, Fetch, that you? Me and the boys are in the back of the parking lot. Come jump on top of the truck. Riding shotgun on the roof again? You're a true gentleman. Yeah, it worked last time. After the hellfire enema you just gave them, they'll be ornery. Animals are dangerous when cornered. Thank you for the frontier wisdom. Out on the docks. Just gotta start opening doors until we find the prize. Well, tell your boys to stay behind me. I don't want anyone blocking my shots. Oh, absolutely. You're the queen on this chessboard, honey. We all know it. Running towards Brent, I felt good. I was going home. Time with him would set my mind straight. No more panic attacks where I'd have to crawl inside my memories just to calm down. He was my rock. I couldn't wait to see him. Come here. Oh, Brent. No 
I'm so sorry, darling, but I'm gonna need to put you on the payroll. At least till I get set up around town, then I promise you will get him back. Fetch, don't. Scout's on. Don't do this. Just a few more jobs. Fetch. No, no, no. I was losing no. it again. I had to find a memory, even a, a bad one, to focus on, to cling to. Being homeless? You're a human cockroach. The evil looks just never stop. But then we got our first taste. And damn, being a cockroach wasn't so bad. But to keep that feeling, we do anything. Prince saw where it was headed. He even hid my stash trying to get me to kick it with him. But I was in too deep. It just felt so good. I couldn't stop. I couldn't. I needed control. When Shane took Brent, I cracked. It sounds like your body was resilient, evolving a new power to help you cope. Yeah, it did. You want to see it? Come at me. Close up with a bunch of guys. You've been holding out on me, Miss Walker. Maybe. Set him up again, I'll give you the real show. Impressive. Why haven't you shown me this before? Maybe because you haven't given me something worth using it on. Let me at some of your dupes, then you'll get the fireworks. Careful what you wish for. Follow the yellow lines, stay in the middle of the hallway. There's no way out. All exits are sealed. In here, I'll allow you to attack holograms of my men, but only on the condition that you no longer hide any of your powers from me. Deal! I spent years running from these guys. Fighting them's more fun. Well done. A weapon is just a tool. You can bend it towards your goals. Come on, I'm not your weapon. You keep talking about my anger trying to get inside my head. Just let me fight! Most DUP agents were ones like you. Lost conduits that needed my help focusing their abilities. But to get the job, they had to survive. You see? You are a weapon. When we picked you up, I suppressed the media, erased you from all the records. Why? Because I saw something in you. Of use. I'm just here for my powers. They make me feel... normal again. No, you are here because of what you did. You want to let the rage out? Then channel it. Fight! All right. And now? Glow, my pretty. Very good, Miss Walker. Keep impressing me like this. I'll put you to work. Take a seat. You were speaking of how Shane had betrayed you. With the occurrence out of the way, Shane set his sights on the chief of police, hoping to strong arm him into some kind of deal. If I helped, obediently doing whatever I was told, he promised to let Brent go. Well, I knew that was a lie. And with more dupes showing up by the hour, I needed a plan B. Fetch! You have a problem. I have a problem? The DUP's have been scooping up my men left and right. If this keeps up, I'm gonna be down to a skeleton crew. 
I'd not have anyone to watch your brother, you know? Make sure he's safe. You know, I'd be happy to teach you boys how to avoid getting caught by the DUP. Now don't get pissy with me. Now these guys are on my ass because of you and your freaky laser shit. Dude, chill. Do it. Busting up that compound will take a few dupes off the streets. It'll give me room to operate. Fine. Just don't forget my boys. I sure won't, boss. Okay, dupes. Today I bust into your house. See how you like it. Man, these guys build fast. Thank you, dupe assholes. I want to. I knew girls in middle school tougher than you guys. Okay, baby Shanes, run for it. Okay, guys, hit the bricks. Oh, crap, they keep getting bigger. Flunkies, you are free to go. Hey, Tex ass. Your goons have been released back into the wild. Oh, you are such a good and faithful little servant. You know, deserve a reward. Fetch? Brent! Where's he got you? I don't know, but forget about me. Leave town before the DUP catch you. Now, you see, honey, you do right by me, you get a little brand. Across me, and I take a little off brand. Maybe an ear. <laughs> or a tooth. Ladies, Julius. I heard Shane has your brother. I'm sorry, but I know him. He'll never let Brent go. Not if you've got something he wants. You speaking from experience? Look, I want help, but it has to stay between us, okay? Go to the middle of the science center. I'll explain there. Jenny, you here? What's the deal? I'm dumping a program onto your phone. You see the wireless video app? Try it. What is this? It's the live feed from a nearby police drone. Shane's about to get total access to these things. He keeps buying off cops. So? So, if you want to look for your brother, without Shane tracking you, you'd better find and destroy these drones. Why are you helping me? Because we were both sick when the trafficker took that girl. I'm stuck in Shane's world, but you don't have to be. Oh, that was expensive. It was. Seriously. They're like 90 grand each. And there's another one at Spruce and Third. These things can go anywhere. If Shane got a hold of one, he'd keep tabs on you day and night. You'd never get close to your brother. I'm sold. Let's trash it. Gotcha, bastard. All right. It looks like the police just brought another one online. It's moving a little faster than the others. You might have a harder time catching it. <laughs> I can do fast. It's kind of my thing.
Fetch, you okay? I'm so sorry, I couldn't tell the drones and chopper apart on my end. Eh, it's fine. I'm not the one who exploded into fiery debris. <laughs> I'll send you the rest of the drone locations. And I might have a lead on where Shane's keeping your brother. <gasps> Might's good enough for me. Shane keeps moving prisoners around, but I think I cracked his system. Oh, you are officially forgiven for that helicopter thing. Tell me where to go and I'm already there. Shane's trying to convince people he's the new occurrence by putting troublemakers inside cargo boxes. That includes my brother? Yeah, although I don't know which one. There are four and they're all guarded. Once you start cracking them open, he got maybe a few minutes before Shane finds out. Then I'll have to move fast. Thank you. First box is nearby. Hey, what are you doing here? They didn't mention that he's down by. Take them down fast before they can call in. It's empty. Then go to the next one. Run, now. Before anyone checks up on those guards you just whacked, I'll try tying up their communications. Should give you a little time, but you gotta move. Shane's anal about his guys giving updates. Every few minutes, they're supposed to call in their status. Keep moving. If I get caught, he'll wonder how I knew about the cargo boxes. He might think it was you. I'll be gone. I'm helping you out with this and then leaving with a clear conscience. <laughs> clear conscience? What did you do? Buy me a drink on the beach somewhere far away from here, and I will tell you. <laughs> Neil! You're running out of time. Jenny, this is all the cop cars. I'm tripping over them out here. The police started working double shifts after you leveled that to you. You, my friend, are public enemy number one. Congrats. Come on, Brent. Please, be in the next box. There's no one in here. Then try the next one. Go! You hurt me. Well, didn't you think I'd notice when all those police drones started going missing? Hmm? Only person that knew about that deal was Jenny. I had to find out if she was still on my team or not. That was all me, and so was this. Oh, please. She's the brains. You're just a laser gun with pink hair. Put her on the phone. Yep, too late. She's already stepped outside. Although, if you hurry, you might be able to catch her. No! Jenny! Now, Fetch, I did what Jenny forced me to do. She knew the price of betraying me. The question is, do you? My brother. You'll kill my brother. That's good. <laughs> now, don't let Jenny's death be a waste. Do what I say, when I say it, and your brother lives. You know what? 
me on top of the Pioneer building. We got cops to kill. Okay, Shane, I'm here. Sorry, darling. I got a little distracted. Get out your phone. You'll see. The cop I paid off finally got me access to their cameras. This here's a live video feed. So? It's a bunch of cops. Yeah, and they're protecting the chief of police. A man I am very eager to meet. Sadly, not with that kind of entourage present. I'm not gonna kill all those dudes just so you can have a sit down. I'll distract them. Stop making a ruckus so they'll have to peel off and investigate. For whatever works, sugar. Now, if this meeting goes the way I see it, I'll be running Seattle for years to come. Meaning you and your brother can go. One ruckus coming up. I thought you were gonna cause a ruckus. Start trashing some cars. That always brings out the pigs. <laughs> Police chief looking around wondering where all his men went. I think I'm gonna go introduce myself. And just in case, come on by. I want my laser gun for protection. It's about time. Keep the cops off my back. I don't want to be interrupted. And don't get any ideas. Your brother's safety depends on my safety. my brother. Been keeping him in a building not three blocks from here. He's your problem now. And that's it? Well, you heard the chief. You leave town and I'm a made man. Smiles all around. Prince! I'm sorry, honey, but the DUP's getting awful close. And now that I got the chief of police in my pocket, you're just a cute little liability. <laughs> Boys and gas, you pussy. Well, can you blame me? It's not like shooting you to death has worked out for I anyone. <laughs> when I get out of here. I know, darling. That's why I gotta make sure you don't. You understand. <laughs> Whenever I'd start to freak out, I'd focus on Brent. It was the only thing that had calmed me down. I clung to a good memory. <coughs> Brent knew that if we didn't leave town, I was never gonna get clean. He started taking risks to make money. I wanted to buy a boat and sneak into Canada. I told him it sounded crazy. But when he came home missing a few teeth, I shaped up. Tried going cold turkey. He stayed by me through all this shit. I owe him. He's my brother. I love him. Nothing was gonna stop me. Shane had Brent. If I couldn't make a deal, how was I supposed to get him back? Excuse me, how did you break out of that tunnel? Did you get another power from that mental snap? Alright, yeah, I was holding out on you. Again. Whatever, I'll show it to you. Just clump up some guys down there.
Impressive. But why are you showing this to me now? Because it's training. It's working. I feel good. Give me something tougher to fight. All right, Miss Walker. Follow the yellow lines. Stay in the middle of the hallway. You seem to have a number of personal demons. The conduit who creates the combat holograms, he's obsessed with the video game about demons. I'm not a fan of the aesthetic, but for training purposes, they'll push you to the limit. It's good to hurt them, doesn't it? We're conduits living in a world of them or us. We must defend ourselves. It looked like you were enjoying yourself. Ride that feeling and unleash your potential. You see what you're capable of? There's a future for conduits who can put their past lives behind them. So tell me how your story ends. With Shane out to kill me, I was out of options. I had to go on the attack. Problem was, I didn't know where to find him or my brother. Is she dead? I hope she's dead. Let's just shoot her some more. You know, just to be sure. Where's Brent? Gotta talk to each other somehow. Ooh, a headset. And just my size. Convoy 3, any sign of Walker? Nope, Shane nailed it. Put all the inventory on trucks. She's not gonna find us. I torch the drugs in those trucks. Shane will come running. Just gotta find him. That'll help. Trucks, run for your lives. Any sign of trouble out there? Getting paranoid. I haven't seen anything. your drugs blowing away on the pavement. You did. Sure did. Bye, honey. Wait, bitch, don't hang up. What the hell's going on? It's gotta be the occurrence. I thought we were done with those guys. Guess who? Listen, bitch. If you wreck one more truck, 
And Brent loses a hand. You hear me? You're not gonna hurt him. No? Test me. What do you think I've been doing? Without him, you have no, absolutely no protection from me. You can't afford for him to get a cold. Keep destroying my property. You will regret it. Looks like you lost another shipment there, Kingpin. Why are you doing this? Give me Brent. It all stops. Oh, no, no, no. You turn yourself into the DUP, then I'll free him. Scout's honor. Sorry, Tex. Come on, it's just one girl! One girl! Send that bitch our way. We'll take her out. Oh, wait. You don't have any. Now, the DUPs are onto you. They know you're after my cargo. And all you can do now is run. You think they might be interested to learn what your cargo is? It's kind of federal offense illegal. They don't care about me. All they're interested in is the freaks. You're the target. I'm just a helpful little citizen. Yeah, I'm sure they'll turn the other way after they get what they want. She's here! Who's where? I don't see her! God damn it, protect that truck! Someone call back up! We need everyone here! Now! Hey, you calling any of your trucks, Shane? Anyone answering? Bitch! <laughs> your gang will be smaller than when I started. Although, can one person even be a gang? Fine. You want me? I'm at the crocodile. You come and get me, and I swear on my mother's grave, I will blow your neon brains all over those walls. Oh, it's a date. Shane! Unloading me because I was a problem? Mom, put the phone down now. You can't do this to her. She's your daughter. I was just a kid. Abigail, 
the DUP are going to make this better. She promised us. Where is she? Fetch run! We have to get out of here! No one's taking me in. That's where my men found you. It was Shane who took your brother. He's the one who put you there, out of control. Given the chance, would you kill him? Then do it. Fetch? Do me a favor, honey. Tell this gal that I am 100% normal American. I already knew your story. It's honor. But I had to make you relive it. I, I, to get you back to the remember. point where you gave I, up. Damn it, I am not one of those freaks. on target. The prisoner has stolen APC-13 heading west on 102. Advising barricaded junction. Over. Hands off, assholes. He's mine. Still tracking APC-13, but no sign of Walker. Copy. Drones have been released to help search. But watch out where you're driving. We're having trouble keeping them aloft in the storm. Acknowledged.
Pursuit of the target on 104. Set up the barricade and lock him down. Use force only if necessary. Acknowledged. Well, honey, what do you say, huh? Find a way out of here? You back off now. Damn you. I ain't afraid of no junkie. What? 
that it, bitch? Target has been executed. Good. She's ready. 